You kill me. You kill yourselves. They finished uh, production and said that um, they thought it would be a good idea if I came in and did the, the ADR for Aaliyah. And initially, you know, I was unsure about you know, how that was going to work. But Michael assured me that um, um, I could do it. And he would walk me through and, and tell me exactly the technique to, um, to make it work. And because Akash is this vampire and this otherworldly creature, that um, although, you know, I have a more masculine voice, that it, that it would work. And if I got the tonality correct, that it would all work within the film. So I went in and he showed me a screening of the film sort of to prepare me for it, you know, because it's a pretty tedious process. And um, once I went in and did it, uh, saw the film, I was able to go in and walk, walk me through and told me how to use my voice and it worked out pretty well in the end. That is enough to start. Initially it was, it was difficult, it was real sad because she wasn't able to be here to see the fruits of her labor. This role was very important to her. And she worked really hard to get it. That is enough to start, stop! And then as, I, as time went on and uh, I watched, I started to realize that, you know, this was her happiest moment when she was performing and, and doing what she loved. And I tried to embrace that emotion more because uh, that's the only way I can cope with, with, the, with the pain of the loss is to try to realize that with the gifts that she left. So that helped me get through it. I mean, after those, those, uh, those shots, those nights, she was so sore for like days afterwards because you have to hold your body in, sus in suspended animation. It's like, it's, it's tough. It's a lot harder than it looks. Movie magic is amazing. The outfits were heavy, cold, and hard but you could never tell watching it. And um, they looked really cool. She was really excited about wearing them, but after she put them on, she was like, whoa, okay. But um, she, was, she was a trooper. She never complained about anything throughout any cold, cold nights, uh, being covered in plastic and only being able to breathe out of like two straws. I mean, never complained. It was just, just a pure inspiration to anyone that wants to work hard and achieve their dreams.